what about what about South Africa? I mean, South yeah. Africa bowled over Scotland this morning. Yeah. Are they the sleeping giants oh, now? No, I mean, are they starting to come back into well, form after losing to Japan in the first round? Well, as I told you two weeks ago when we had that silly Tohinari on the, <laughs> on the show, who tried to tell us South Africa was finished. He owes us $20 yeah, each because he, he uh, told us that Scotland would beat that's South That's right. If you're watching Toe, you'll never be invited back again <laughs> to talk about rugby anyway. But, but the reality, he's trying to tell us South Africa was out there a sleeping giant. Mm. You know, that was they, they just had a terrible game against Japan. Look, it, lots of lot, most countries can beat most countries. It's only us, mm. the All Blacks, who never get beaten by yeah. hopefully Ireland, Argentina, Scotland. Mm. Uh, they had a terrible day at the office against Scotland. They are a dangerous team. I they've watched they've lost their captain morning. though, Rua. They've yeah. lost Sean de Villiers. Probably good. Probably is that good a good thing? It this probably well, is a good thing. Actually. Yeah, it depends how close the close the crunch games are. I think. I think uh, if South Africa are out comfortably in the quarters and the semis, if they make it that far, then um, it's not really going to matter. Yeah. But in those really close games, I think someone like John de Villiers, you, you'll really notice um, him not being. They still got Victor Metfield there, though, you? But mind you, he's is he he's not starting at the moment. No, is he? he's, he's on 30, the bench. He's 37, you know, and uh, he's got the experience there to make I the mean, big calls. I mean, Ruin knows about experience. I think he's right in a way, but but the, the brilliance is with these younger backs yep. in South Africa, yeah, isn't yeah. it? You know, but uh, mm, oh, I mm. mean, they, they are so dangerous. The box. And, and what about the All Blacks? Let's focus on the All Blacks because uh, you know they struggled a little bit against Georgia for about the first 70 minutes. Uh, yeah. yeah, I don't think it's all doom and gloom, though. I think uh, I think looking at it, they're actually trying to put themselves under a lot of pressure. Uh, I, I actually. I actually think it's a good thing that um, these mistakes are happening, and, and it's just skill, skill, skill factor things. So they're just dropping balls and throwing loose passes, which is mm. which are easy, easy fixes. But I think they they weren't kicking the ball. Mm. They I, I think they're deliberately uh, putting themselves under pressure so that when the heat comes on in the quarters and the semis, they're not going to freak out. It's very perceptive, mm. Oh, That's a good call. They well, didn't kick I, the I ball. I think I think they really, You've probably been down the coast too long with that. <laughs> 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 Come on, brother. I mean, if that All Black side's not a trouble. Well, I don't know uh, who is. Well, you know, you look back over the past and and uh, and past World Cups where we've looked a million oh, dollars in, in the it's pool true. games. That's true. You know, yeah. when yeah, the they, heat came yeah, on. Yeah, Rue might, be, might hey, he I might think he's onto on something. Well, and Steve he Hansen has come out this morning and said that they are holding oh, back. Look, they don't look, want to reveal all of their tricks at this. Well, look, let's hope Steve's right and let's hope Rue is right. I think they're in big trouble. If Carter can't play well against Georgia, what makes what makes us think he's going to play well against Ireland or South Africa or Australia? I think, you know, that I've never seen them look so bad. I mean, I'm, I'm a bit negative as anything, but really, uh, four years on from 2011, don't tell me they're as good as they well, were in 2011. I know the next statement's probably going to make me public enemy number one here in Aotearoa, yeah. but I think Carter is a liability. Yeah, well, I, I, I would have had Sopoanga any time any time. Rua's not agreeing with us. What do you say? Oh, oh, <laughs> I, actually, you're, actually, the, you're the rugby expert. <laughs> no, no, I, I agree. I agree. Sapuang is brilliant and, and everything, but I, just the same thing again. I think when when you're in the cauldron and, you, and you're, you're, you know, the heat is on and you're in semi-finals. Can Carter do it for us? 